Okay, so I watched the PSO2 New Genesis version 2 trailer, and I am extremely disappointed. I played PSO2 New Genesis for a while. I stopped playing just before the Fire Region came out. I came back for a little bit after it was released, but then I just stopped playing altogether and uninstalled the game. And the reason for that was because leveling up classes became extremely repetitive and just boring, especially since, you know, things take a lot of XP to get to max level, and it just became a whole thing, and I just didn't want to bother with it anymore. And also the lack of new enemies and photon arts also just only made things worse, right? And there's a whole conversation to be had about, you know, photon arts and, you know, c combat customization and all this stuff, but I don't really want to get into it. But when I saw the trailer was titled PSO2 New Genesis version 2, I thought, oh good, they're going to be hopefully adding more classes and photon arts to the game that are in, you know, in base PSO2, and they're going to try to address the issues with the content loop that New Genesis has, you know, give a little bit more variety in enemies and that kind of thing, right? But that's not even close to what version 2 actually is at least from my point of view. To me, it seems like just an update that adds base building, which I think would be fine if the game wasn't so incredibly fucking stale. Also, the trailer is clearly meant to try and get new people into the game, rather than trying to appeal to the people that are already playing the game, which seems to be just like an extra knife in the back, so that was also just really upsetting. But although, to be fair, it's not really my place to say that as someone who hasn't stuck with the game myself. Maybe base building has been what people are clamoring for. I, I don't know. I doubt it, though. Um, to me, this trailer and what the developers are calling version 2 of New Genesis is going to be what kills the game for people who are holding on to hope that, there were, that, you know, that they would fix the major problems that the game has. And to me, what solidifies it is the statement at the end of the trailer. Unleash your creativity, live your fantasy. I don't know about anyone else, but to me, that just screams, we turned PSO2 into a dress-up simulator, and we're doubling down on that. But those are just my thoughts as someone who stopped playing and has been out of the loop. Maybe others will see some positives in the trailer that I didn't. But um, yeah, anyway, that was pretty much all that I wanted to say.